Richie? Yeah? Put in your bit. Give me some more details. How did it happen? Some fucking drunk killer? No. It was a rainy night. The brakes on the car weren't great. She had to stop suddenly. She slid on the road. She crashed. She died. She died right away? Not quite. She was trapped in the wreck for about six hours before she passed on. Yeah. Those acts of God really stick it in and break it off, don't they? Yes, they do. Is that real? Yes. I've seen one of these things before. A friend of mine had himself ordained a minister of his own religion. Some way to fuck the IRS. Is that what you're doing? Are you the real McCoy? Real McCoy? You're a preacher? I was a minister. Was, as in not anymore? Yes. Why'd you quit? I think I've gotten about as up close and personal with you as I'm going to get. Let's just keep this friendly, OK, Pops? Let's I get too sensitive. Oh, you're right. Enough with the getting to know you shit. All right. I don't give a rat's ass about you or your fucking family. You can all live forever, or you can die this second. And I don't give a shit which. The only things that I care about are me, that son of a bitch back there in the back, and our money. So you help us get across the border without incident. You stay with us through the night without trying anything funny, without trying to escape. And in the morning, I'm going to let you guys go, all of you. How do I know you'll keep your word? You have to convince me you're telling the truth. Look, dickhead, the only thing that you have to be convinced about is the fact that you are stuck in a situation with a couple of real mean motor scooters. And I don't want to have to worry about you all fucking night. You know, I don't think you want to be worrying about my brother's intentions towards your daughter all night, either. Did you notice the way that he was looking at her? Yes. You didn't like it, did you? No, I didn't. I didn't think so. You get us into Mexico, and you don't try to escape, and your daughter will be safe, morning, I will let you go. I give you my word, Jacob. If he touches her, I'll kill him. Fair enough. You break your word, I'll kill all of you. 